Hi, I'm Jarrell. And I'm Tatsuya. And welcome to the Art of Mashup, where we take foods you love or hate, mash them together, and give them a taste test. And if that fails, we try and create a new fusion dish inspired by the combination. And today we have something that I am like both looking forward to and dreading at the same time. We're doing pig's feet and fish sticks. I've never eaten pig's feet before. I know it's kind of a staple here in the South of the US. And I've just never wanted to try it because this just doesn't look appetizing at all. Tasia has been looking forward to this though. He loves pig's feet. This so. is probably the worst thing I'll probably eat on the show. We did mayo. I honestly, mayo is put on like every single thing by people who are disgusting. That I don't means see them you putting pig's feet on like burgers or fish fillets. Well, who knows? Maybe after this, we're going to start. I I can't believe you put that on the list. So, let's see what it is. Pig's feet. It's semi boneless. So there's still bones in here yeah. and it's packed in vinegar. And it's going to be good. It's going to be amazing. Hey, yeah. it's gluten-free. You can open it. All right, I, I just expect to be hit with just a uh, horrid smell. <sighs> Ready? Let's go. Let's go. Oh! <laughs> it's right on the oh, top. Oh, what is that? What is that? Is that brine? Yeah, it's brine. Is it gooey? Touch it. Touch it. Oh, it smells like ketchup. It actually doesn't smell like anything. I'll just <laughs> oh, no, put it on your plate. Oh, God. It looks like a nose. Like someone's nose. Eat it. Put it in your mouth. No. Like, how do people eat this? This is... It's meat jelly, kind of. Oh, Is how soft it's gotten. All right, Tatsuya. And this is found in, in like, major grocery stores. Like, yeah. what? Eat it. No. Do it. No. It's for the greater good. All right, so since I've never had this before, I'm at least going to try it just by Dude. itself. Dude. Come on. I am going to throw up. I swear to God. And I don't even... I don't throw oh. up. Actually, it's not that bad. Mostly, you taste vinegar and... It kind of reminds me of, I don't eat this anymore because I found out what they were. But when I was young, I really used to like eating um, what's called either chitlings or chitlings, which is, you know, pig intestine. Then I found out what they were and I was disgusted and never ate it again. Pork poop shoot. That's what this tastes like. I don't want to taste that. Well, come on, go for it. Can I get a different piece? No. Let me go. No. Yours no. is the Oh man. Just use your fork, cut it, and taste it. Mm. Does it taste like bacon at all? <laughs> no, no, not at all. Eat it. Come on. We can't keep everyone waiting. That's that's the nail right there. That's the toenail. Bro, get the f out of here, man. <laughs> I, I ate a piece. Eat another one. No, that's not how this works. <laughs> what is that? Like, what the f is that? Oh, wait. Ah, uh, you need a, you know how we do things. You need a good ratio. That is nothing comparatively. It doesn't matter. I still, I'm still eating it. No, you're not. It's like with the mayo thing. I hate mayo. It's disgusting. I still ate it, even though it was, yeah. Look, same size. No. Same get size. Get you some, get you a good amount of that. You know, like this. See that? Eat it. See that ratio? Yeah, eat it. Eat it. Eat it. You fucking weirdo. You need more. You need more than that. Uh, I'm not gonna look at it. I'm not gonna look at it. Just some more. Can't even see it. It's not even there. Dude, that was disgusting, bro. <laughs> that was. Oh. You want a piece of this one? Let me flip it over. Look more appetizing now? No. Put that up, man. <laughs> Can we move on? I, I, I think Tetsu is just sort of broken for now. This is by far the worst thing I've ever, like ever. That's how I feel about mayo. That's not 
even comparable. It's comparable. Not even. We're gonna see if we can make this better and we'll be back with you. Eat it. All right, we're back, and we have this lovely, nasty-looking dish. Why you gotta copy me, bro? This, and this, and look, look at it. It's got noodles, it's got cilantro, it's got nasty-ass pig feet, it's got fish sticks, and we have bean sprouts. So, tell us about it, Jarrell. How was the cooking process? This one had to, um, those pig's feet, so they're a bit tougher and don't have as much meat on them. So I ended up using it to make sort of a stew or actually more of a soup. Pig feet ramen. It is not ramen, kinda. So it's lime, cilantro, of course the pig feet for the broth, garlic, various seasoning. And yeah, just long, let that cook for 12 hours. Dang. It has like this strain. What is that aroma I'm smelling? Is that the pig feet or the cilantro? Don't know. Uh, it's, it has like a very, almost a nutty, nutty smell. It does have mushrooms in it, but. Oh, mushrooms. Oh, it's spicy. Mm -hmm. Nice. I like that. It distract me from the nastiness of the feet. Yeah, and you know, I've got a piece here, just the stew so the bones are kind of just falling off of it. Mm. Tastes good, Jarrell. Delicious. You didn't try a piece of that pig? So yes, I did. No, you didn't. You don't know what I ate. I was literally watching you. It was good. It tasted good. Also, I'm the one who made the serving, so... No, 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 no. Oh, I got... That looks delicious. You should go for it. Get a nice bite of that. Okay, let me get the juices all over it. It smells good, and it's spicy, and I like that. Mostly I say this actually is pretty good. Uh, but this one, it wasn't pickled pig's feet, it was fresh pig's feet. A pickled is... It's weird. It's weird. It actually does taste good. What, pickled? Oh, this. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it does. Eat it. It tastes good. Eat it. I tasted it. Yeah, see that nice piece right there? The one you covered up with the noodles? For everything we do, you Look, gotta get a nice- I got it, I got it. Come on, don't don't half-ass it. I do it. Just, it, it tastes nothing at all like the first one did. Good, well, okay. Oh. Come on, take it, a big bite. It tastes like rib fat. It definitely, uh, you can, it definitely tastes like pork, I will say that, but it's a little grittier than pork or than like you know ribs really? yeah it has like a grainy like meaty i don't know maybe it's just the way that it was prepared there's no but i refuse to eat this skin i'm just not gonna do it right right eat the meat it just looks weird like it, it does it looks weird so the meat on the bone is not bad and the soup itself is actually pretty good and i feel like we've just kind of neglected our fish sticks but yeah, they're in here, they don't add very much. Yeah. Well, it's kind of hard it's to- It's mainly because of the breading. Mm -hmm. The breading breaks off and it does add thickness to the soup. And that kind of helps with it because it helps cover everything in that sort of nice, spicy and flavorful taste that it has to it. Then it ends up just looking like this, which was a fish stick, but now it's just fish. A filet. You know, the dish itself is actually really good. 
It's just my... I'm too freaked out by pig's feet. I'm certain if you didn't know oh, there were pig's feet, you would still eat it. What, the pickled? No, these. This? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, like, if I went to, like, a ramen shop and they just gave me some ramen and they were like, oh, yeah, it's pork. And then I didn't know that they put pig's feet in it. Yeah, I'd eat it. it but it's something about knowing what it is. Yeah, you're it always doing gets you. Yeah, it always gets me. I would say this is maybe... maybe I'd give it an eight. I'd probably give it a six. Just, I mean, it was good, but it's not, not my thing, bro. Not my thing. You say eat those feet, sweet. All right, so that's it for the Art of Mashup this week. Make sure to like and subscribe to keep up to date on all of our new episodes. And next week, I um, hope we're gonna have something fun. So let's go ahead and figure out what that's going to be. All right, G58. And 43. Yum. 43 sauerkraut. 58 grenadine. What the hell is grenadine? <laughs> so, is think of it as cherry syrup. What?